Today we are going to talk about staged air volume or SAV units and what's the difference between a staged air volume unit and a typical rooftop unit. The staged air volume unit is going to have a VFD or variable frequency drive. The VFD will control the blower motor to two distinctive speeds a low speed for ventilation and first stage cooling and then at a high speed for heat and second stage cooling. This is pre-configured at the factory. Using the VFD to drive the blower motor at two distinctive speeds is more efficient than using a two-speed motor. Combined with the ability to run the unit at a part load makes the SAV unit much more efficient than your typical rooftop unit. Along with the VFD, the SAV unit has a fan speed control board. Depending on the mode of operation, relays on the board will send a 24 volt DC signal to the VFD to control the blower speed. So what's the difference between a typical rooftop unit and an SAV unit? Simply the VFD and the fan speed control board. Also the blower motor is designed to operate on a VFD and if it were to be replaced, a direct replacement should be used. One of the questions that come up is how to configure the VFD. You will notice that the VFD has no keypad on it. This is because the VFD is pre-configured at the factory and no field adjustments are required. Startup of the SAV unit is very similar to a typical rooftop one difference would be after checking the compressor rotation and correcting it if necessary, the blower motor rotation should be checked. If incorrect, any two leads between the VFD and the motor must be switched. Also, the ventilation dampers should be set to the correct position for both high and low speed blower operation to provide the correct amount of fresh air. The unit start up checklist found in the installation instructions should be filled out during the startup. Remember the SAV unit is similar to the typical rooftop unit but much more efficient due to the ability to operate at a part load.